Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Mori's Plays Let's Play of Animal Crossing New Leaf. It is not snowing today, even though we're playing around the same time, it's pretty light out. Um, so, yes, yeah, it's, it's weird how the weather makes it all feel so different. Uh, it's quite a, an awake atmosphere at the moment, not so cosy as it was yesterday. Um, we need to check our... Well, is there a camper here today? No. Ooh! Red, crazy reds here. We might finally be able to get some artwork. I was going to say we need to get our um, turnip price today, and um, because we only we only sold half our turnips yesterday, so we're going to check out the turnips, and I think we're going to head to the tropical island maybe and, and see if there's a wetsuit for sale because we need to start catching some sea creatures. I think. Uh, do we risk going into red straight away? Hmm. That is the question. Or should, should we search for some more fossils? Hey, Inkwell. Ooh, there's one hiding right behind these flowers. There we go. Look, I dug up a fossil. So two fossils already. We're making record time. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> What's going on? Is it? Oh, it is a fossil. I thought it might be a gyro this time. Um, because we had lots of snow yesterday. Should, there should be at least one or two gyroids kicking around as well. Um, okay, we may as well head into Red, see what he has for sale. Hopefully something cool and real. Okay. Red, oh ho, welcome to my gallery. Come in and see some art. Oh boy, cousin, when was the last time you were here? Well, I'm rather pleased to see you back again. I'll tell you, this week's items as rare as they come. I'm almost green with envy that I can't buy them all. But remember, we only sell one per customer, so make your choice very carefully. One per customer. And I haven't done any research either, oh no. It's, hard, it's so hard to know. Can we see the backs of them? Is there a clue? I know on New Horizons, the ones, the real ones have a sticker on the back. That one looks like it might be. I think the fake version of that one normally is smiling, so that could be real. Um, oh, I'm useless when it comes to the statues. Is that... that? I don't know what I'm looking for. Oh no, we should, maybe we should get a guide up. This one, it, I, I feel like it, that was here last time, wasn't it? There was something with the arm. Or was that the different statue? I can't remember. Um, it's so hard to say. I think, since we can only buy one, I've got a feeling this one is... Ooh, it's hard to know, because I don't know if that one's... I've got, I've got a feeling this one because he's not smiling. and I'm pretty sure we've seen this one. And he's smiling in the fake one. So we'll go with this one. Uh, it's a shame we can't buy more than one. But the scary painting. Yes, definitely. The scary painting wouldn't be smiling, would it? So this has got to be real. Well, I see you've got your eyes only for the scary painting there. I'd say it has eyes for you. I must say that's quite amazing. So between you and me, I'm selling that for just 3,920 bells. This time and this time only. Ooh, is that a threat? Does that mean you're going to raise the price if we come back later? Uh, what do you think? You want it? Oh, oh, well, yeah, I'm, I've, I've got an inkling. I'm pretty confident about that. Well, really? What a shock. Well, obviously, you have to be as crazy as me to pass it up. Let me just get that sweet, sweet payment and we'll be all set. Okay, got it. Well, then, I'll mark this scary painting as a sold item. Everyone else is out of luck. Uh, don't you worry, I'll wrap this up nice and safe and mail it over to us. Oh, yes, we don't even get it today. It gets mailed, of course. We did buy a painting last time, but it was fake. And Blathers almost had a fit. It was it was savage. <laughs> uh, but remember, if your mailbox is full, it won't get delivered. So make sure you've got uh, the space ready. Oh, yes, we do need to check our mail. Um, okay, art experts. Is this real or fake? Is this real or fake? And hopefully I was right with this being real. And is this real or fake? I don't know. Does Red only have one real one in this version? I know it differ differs in different versions. So, okay, Red, I think we spent enough money today. <laughs> See you later. Maybe next week. Ah, cousin, I just know this work of art will find its true home now that you've decided to buy. I'll be sending you my purchase off to you as soon as the exhibi uh, exhibition is over. Wait, uh, so keep wait, watch for it. Can't seem to spit my words out today. 
Maybe I'm too excited with all the fake art. Okay, let's go and check quickly if our perfect peaches have grown back. Um, because we have a perfect peach tree over here. Oh no, it hasn't grown back yet. Oh, what's this? Another fossil hiding. Look, I dug up a fossil. Wait, how many is that now? Is that three? Four! So it's, I think we get four or five fossils a day, so we might not find any more. Um, I think you can get five, actually, if uh, if you don't find gyroids. But with it snowing yesterday, I'm pretty confident we'll find gyroids. Take the gem. Really want to be doing some more public works projects as well. Maybe we should go and do that. Um, really want to get the police stations in town as well. But they ha I think they have to be... Um, they have to be suggested by villagers, so we literally have to just wait until the villagers like, Oh, hey, I think we need a police station. <laughs> hey, Isabel, working hard or hardly working? Oh, Mayor, I just remembered. The townsfolk would like to hold a ceremony to celebrate... Oh, the, the dream suite. Where, do, where does that? Do we go to the main street? That would be so cute. Uh, I considered you the one who made it all possible. We want you to attend. Sure. Let's have a little celebration. Hooray! The ceremony we held outside the train. Oh, outside the train station. Would have been so cute to have everyone on Main Street. Um, hello everyone. Welcome to the grand completion ceremony of Moriland's vital Dream Suite project. Thank you for joining us on this momentous occasion. I'm Isabel and I'll be your host today. Well done, Isabel. Thank you, thank you, <laughs> you're too kind. Uh, we're going to keep this short and sweet, so let's jump right in. First up, we have an incredibly short speech from our very own mayor. Oh, she knows us so well already. Definitely gonna be a short speech. Um, hooray for everyone. <laughs> Yay. Let's all pat our backs. Well done, everyone. Well said, Mayor. You have quite a way with words. Okay, moving on. Everyone, please locate that item we passed out earlier and get ready. And now, to celebrate the completion of this public works project and all the hard work that made this possible. Ready, set, pop! <laughs> Yay! That concludes our ceremony. Thanks everyone for all your hard work and for taking the time out of your busy schedules to be here. Oh, hey everyone. Woohoo, group hug. <laughs> Lobo, how are you? Hey, Mori, hey, I'm impressed to see you're surviving. Why does Lobo always doubt our survival? What's that about? So you wanted to talk to me, wanna chat? We sent you a letter the other day and you haven't even acknowledged it yet. Can I come hang out at your place today? I'm just curious to know what kind of place you live in. Okay. Great. Can we go there now? Now you've just got to figure out the minor details. You probably want to get ready, so let me know when it's convenient for you. After 6.30? Okay, we probably won't be on by then, but... Excellent. That's perfect for me. See you at 6.30 p.m. Remember to clean. Are you saying we're not clean? Uh, yes, by the way, this... Oh, no! <laughs> No, I was about to say, by the way, this is a pitfall for everybody who keeps asking in the comments. I leave it there so no, one doesn't spawn in, but it looks like one might spawn in tomorrow. Oh, I can't believe I did that. Okay, back to Isabel. We we're supposed to be doing a public work project. Um, and then we need to go to the campgrounds because we have Philly back. And we need to order some things. Um, oh! Fossil? Oh, gyroid! Look, I dug up a mega quasoid. I wish there was a, like, uh, how at the museum you can have a checklist of what you've, uh, like, an encyclopedia. They should really do one for the gyroids, I feel like. Where's the town hall gone? Okay, so what public work project should we do? We haven't really got any others. Other than the default ones you start with. So none of the villagers have, have mentioned any yet. Hi, Mayor Mori. Is there something I can help you with? Uh, yes, public works projects, please. Do you want to work on a public works project? I'm happy to help. What would you like to work on? We want to start a new project. Here are the current requests from the townspeople. 
Okay, so we don't want any more bridges, really. Um, we want something cool. The fence is cool. Fire hydrant. <laughs> oh, the windmill is a classic wind turbine. Oh, the lighthouse. Uh, I feel like the windmill would be a good one because it's not so expensive. Um, oh, the lighthouse is so cool. Let's, oh, okay, let's do the wind turbine first. And then we'll, maybe next time we'll do the lighthouse. Because uh, we, we, we'd be running out of money at this point. Uh, would you like to start a, work on a wind turbine project? Yeah. As long as we can move it again if we decide we don't like it. Yay, let's go find a place to build. Okay, Mayamori, please lead me to a spot where you'd like to place the wind turbine. Ooh, we've got a balloon present. I can hear it. Where is it? Oh, there it is. There's the shadow. Another present. We're going to see how many presents we can keep left, uh, leaving on the ground before someone says something. <laughs> uh, look, I've got a mega gongoid. So what's that? Four fossils and two gyroids. So that's like six. I don't think there'll be any more than six. Oh! <laughs> we talked it up. So what's that? Seven dig spots today. Three gyroids, four fossils, mini lullabaloid. Actually, we've had a lot. We definitely had a lullabaloid before. Definitely don't think we'll see any more. Although now I've said that, we probably will. <laughs> okay, where where should we put a wind turbine? It's going to be windy down by the coast, isn't it? Uh, what's the matter, Mayor? Let's finish our work first. Oh, we can't put things on the beach, I remember. So we have to put it on the cliff somewhere. I f Ooh, I feel like this little indentation might be a good place. Let's see if we can put it here. Uh, here? Yes, Mayor! Is this where, about where you'd like to place the wind turbine? What do you think? Well, let's see. Yes, I think it would be perfect. It will probably look something like this when it's all finished. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. What do you think? Is this the spot? That's definitely the spot. Just on the edge of the cliff will be perfect. Understood. Well, let's go ahead and start the needed preparations. All set. To help us gather donations to fund the wind turbine are, is our town, Gyroid Lloyd. It's going to be hard to wait for all the donations to arrive, so we... Okay. <laughs> That's basically is what I'm saying. Unless you help out, nudge, nudge, it's gonna be a little while. Well, I must return to the town hall. Ah, uh, you don't need to worry about making the trip back, Mayor. Okay, then I'll be taking my leave. Okay. Isabel, she must run back to the town hall. Scared she might miss out on some work. <laughs> okay, we may as well check our mail today since we're doing a terrible job of checking our mail. Uh, I think we'll have some uh, campground stuff. Potentially. Oh no, finally people are uh, writing back to us. Lobo, I could get used to receiving gifts every day. Thanks. Look at that. I actually got something for you too. What a coincidence. Take care of it. Aha. Oh, what did Lo Lobo get us? Oh, an ornate rug. Okay, Kid Cat sent a present as well. Uh, sup, Mori? I got your present right after breakfast. Thanks, buddy. I was surprised by your present, but not as surprised as you're going to be. Booyah! Treat it right, buddy. From Big Kid Cat. <laughs> okay, what did Kid Cat get us? A red check tea. Nice. Claudia as well with the presents. Dear Mori, you know it'd be rude to ask for that present back, right? I was just kidding. Uh, think I was just thinking how I've been wanting to give you a gift too. Isn't that strange? Sorry if you don't need it. Ah, oh. Claudia is quite sweet. Uh, ooh, a pepper mill. What's a pepper mill? Uh oh, peaches didn't like the peaches. Thank you very much for writing such a heartfelt note. Okay, let's. Uh, I'm counting on you to convey my gratitude to my friend Maury. Please come over to play. Oh, we got might have a play date with peaches. And, ooh, a present from Chester as well. Uh, a plank flooring. Okay, what did Chester have to say? I've been carrying what you sent me around town and people are noticing. Please don't tell anyone it was a present because I like the attention. <laughs> uh, uh oh, bunny. 
Your letters totally moved me to tears. How do you do it? Writing letters is my fave way to practice writing song lyrics. So you should try it. You should come on over. And text as well. Uh, to my beloved Maury. Whoa, it's so strange that I reread the heartfelt letter you sent me. I felt all cheerful again. I wonder how one gets as talented with words as you are. Oh, that's really sweet. But we're not actually that talented, to be fair. <laughs> okay, I think we need to make a trip to the... Um, museum we're going to donate our fossils have a quick tour of the bugs or fish probably the fish because we haven't really donated many bugs to be honest and then we're going to head back to the campground i think so let's let's go hey digby always on guard <laughs> so many shops in main street now oh let's check if club lol is open because why isn't it open yet? It's been over a week, hasn't it? Still nothing. Can't get in. Or is it this one? It's one of them. Okay, so let's head back to Blathers. Hopefully we're happy. We've got four fossils. And we discovered the other day we're only about halfway through the collection. So hopefully we don't get too many doubles. Who? It's me! <laughs> oh dear, pardon me. Welcome to the Moriland Museum. Hmm, oh, how may I be of a service? Assess fossils, please. Ooh, what would you like me to assess? One, two, three, four fossils. Oh, more than one I see. Let's take a closer look. Come on. Oh, I do believe I found... Whew! For a second there, I, I seemed to hesitate for a bit. I thought he was going to say we've got them all. Something that's not yet part of our museum's collection is really most stunning. I believe you have a natural talent for fossils. I'm rather jealous. I hope I can perhaps convince you to assist with Moriland's cultural education. In the meantime, I shall return these to you. Do think about donating, though. We will. May I offer any further assistance? Yep, you can accept our donations. <laughs> How ironic, almost. Uh, what would you like to donate? Uh, ooh, three out of four. So we've got a T-Rex tail, yes. Oh, no! Two T-Rex two tails. And a Mega Caro torso. Ooh, ooh, several things I see. Let's take a look, shall we? Yes, we will gladly take these off your hands. Ah, there's no need for you to pull them out. I'll handle the rest from here. Also, you're donating multiples of the same item, but we only need one, so you can keep the extra. We pride ourselves in exhibiting all donations in a timely manner. Thank you very much. Uh, may I offer any further assistance? Nothing. Okay. I was going to say do the bugs next, but I've realized we've only donated like two bugs. So let's check out the fish aquarium. Um, not as beautiful as New Horizons, but a vast improvement compared to previous uh museums no sea fish we need to go sea fishing okay let's look in the other room <laughs> i thought we donated oh here we go hey there's our big sunfish and our football fish and our tuna our horse mackerel squid red snapper oh we can turn oh wow I think there's a dab in there as well. Let's have a look. Oh, it does. T it tells you all of them. Horse mackerel, sea bass, red snapper, dab, olive flounder, squid, football fish, tuna, sun, ocean sunfish. Cool. The sunfish is literally just chilling. It's like, I'm just swimming here. Just chilling. The rest are really active. Apart from the football fish. Football fish by name, football fish by nature, I guess. Okay, let's go into the next room. Oh, hey, Tex. Haven't seen anyone in the museum yet. Hey, hello, Maury. You meeting someone here? Perfect spot for it. Uh, so what can I do for you? I want to chat. I bet you're still quite a few fish swimming around out there You've yet, uh, we've yet to see. Yeah, 100%. Uh, looks like our little butterfly fish is swimming in there. Uh, we've got a couple of fish. Oh, is that a sea? Uh, wait, what's that? Is that the normal bass? So these are the river fish for sure. Oh, is that the goldfish? Yeah, oh, the goldfish is really cute. Is there a seating area? No, no seats in this area. 
Okay, Tex, well, hey, wait a minute. I've just realized you're a penguin. I hope you're in here to observe and only observe. We don't want you eating and gobbling up uh, our donations. <laughs> Does this take you back? Yeah, it takes us back to the main room where we haven't got anything in here yet. This must be for s mostly sea creatures. Um, so we definitely need to get a wetsuit. Might not have time today now, but maybe we'll do that tomorrow. Always amazes me just how quick it goes in in each episode. Okay, off to the campground. Because we need to meet Philly. Order some more furniture. I always say this, but we need to start doing things with our um, with our house. But in order to do that, of course, we need lots of furniture. And I'm one of these players that I just prefer having lots of matching furniture. Like I like the whole sets. So until I manage to get sets, the house looks so messy. I can't seem to make anything good unless the sets are matching. So, oh, another present. Hey, oh, it's behind the tree. <laughs> Okay, who have we got today? Wait, what's this? What is that? Is that a clock or a sign? Oh, that's Jack. Definitely got pumpkins on it. And Philly is back. Have to remember what we ordered last time. Hello there. I'm just getting settled in here, but it's already feeling like the second home. Well, you have been here twice, to be fair. But we do have to do our traditional beep beep. <laughs> I don't even know why that's funny, but it really is. Um, okay, should we get straight to ordering some things? Is that a light? Oh, wow! The thrill of being on the open road only lasts for so long. That's why I've collected a bunch of songs to make long drives more entertaining. For example, ever heard of... The song 99 Bottles of Black Tea on the Wall. It's a personal favourite. I'm sure it is, Philly. You are a strange horse. Okay, so... Ooh, what do we want to go for? Do we want the walls? Or do we want to stick with the furniture for now? I feel like we should have a counter. Let's buy the counter. Because um, we bought all the shelves before, the display cases. So, And let's just buy... Oh, let's just... Oh, I don't know. It's always such a tricky... Tricky thing. We got the baskets and the soft drinks, didn't we? Um, what about a hot snack counter? Because we can only do three per day. And then what was the other counter? A steamed bun case. There we go. What are steamed buns? Are they like savoury things? Or are they sweet like donuts? I don't know. Uh, okay, Philly, anything else to say? Any words of wisdom? Hmm, smell that air. I've noticed that each town has its own signature scent. Whenever I arrive somewhere new, this isn't new, you've been here before. Uh, I always take a big whiff of the place. Ew. Can't do anything on this side of the thing and we can't change the camera angle in these campers I don't think no okay Philly it was nice to uh, nice to see you again you'll have to definitely come back because we need all the 7-eleven furniture see you later okay does this work ah uh, yay is that a public work project we can get at some point as well Harvey do you have anything to say today hey there how can I help you Hiya, Harv. Harv? Oh, you mean me. Well, how are you right back at you, friend? Wait, how do you know each other? Is my old noodle really getting that soggy? Oh, brother. Just look at this peaceful little place we've carved out in nature here. Watch the birds uh, flitting, to and f flit flitting to and fro. Mind where you're standing, though. That's uh, that's right where uh, nature co- Ugh. Okay. <laughs> So we won't get our new 7-Eleven items until tomorrow. Um, how much space have we got in our pockets? Not a lot. Um, rearrange our gyros a bit cause, uh, with things that we like to keep. We can pretty much sell all the stuff we got off of the... Oh, I want to see what a pepper mill is, so we'll keep a hold of that. 
Is it like a, a pepper, like a salt and pepper shaker? I think it might be. Uh, oh, our bananas are back. We could go and harvest the bananas. Um, not that Gulliver's going to be here, but I always like to check the beach because he won't be here because Red's here today. Um, but we may as well check. Oh, uh, this is our coconut tree. It's growing. Okay, let's get our bananas. Maybe we should plant some more banana trees. Because you can't really do anything else with the beach. Um, other than plant bananas and coconuts. <laughs> so, we may as well make the most of it. Okay, we can't for some reason... Pick them up. It should go into the basket straight away. It's a bit annoying that it doesn't do that. But that's okay. We can work around it. Each basket can hold uh, nine, nine bananas, or nine bunches of bananas, should I say? How many we got now? Six. Might as well shake them all down. <laughs> yep. I, I'm. Uh, oh, we haven't checked turnips. Mustn't forget turnips. We definitely will also get a wetsuit tomorrow that is the main objective and then we can finally go deep sea diving because uh, we haven't been able to do that yet have we there we go two more bananas one more banana okay let's plant some bananas it's a real shame that we can't put things on the beach let's see how we should be able to just keep going like this. No, too close to the water. We want space to fish. Okay, let's not dig too many holes, just in case. Bury one. There we go. These will take a few days to grow, but as we slowly run out of money, which is inevitable with our debts getting bigger and more public work projects, we're going to need as many fruit trees as possible because they're probably the quickest um, and easiest way to make money. So, oh, eight bananas left. I don't know if we should we plant them all. We may as well. It seems like a lot, though. We want to save some space for some coconuts. Um, how many did we just plant? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we'll just plant six at a time because that will match the other side. So I feel like that's good enough. Um, we desperately need to go and check our turnips. So we'll just do that. Uh, and then we can sell everything that's in our pockets as well. While we're there. Hopefully, oh, if the turnips are a really good price, like even higher than yesterday, we'll have to come all the way back to our storage to get our turnips. But... It was quite high yesterday, so I don't know if it will be. Oh, hello there. Welcome. And also, when we get more crystals from rocks, we'll finally be able to start customising things. Yes, how can I help you? Turn it prices, please. Please be good, because we could do with some money. Oh, no. <laughs> Currently, I'm buying each turn it for 62 bells. Wow. Well, that would be a huge loss, because we did it for, like... Was it, it was over 100. I can't even remember, but that, we didn't want to lose like a third or a half of the value. Definitely don't want to do that. Uh, I want to keep the T-Rex tail. Sell the carpet, the tea, the flooring, the bananas, the pepper mill. Oh, I do want to see what the pepper mill looks like. Could be cute to put on a table if it is what I think it is. Is that everything? I'll start crunching the numbers right away. Well, then I could probably part with 6,307 bells for all of it, if that sounds okay with you. Deal. Actually, we could display our pepper mill in here. See if anyone wants to buy it. Oh, would you like to put something up the flea market space? I would. That way we get to see what it looks like and probably sell it as well. There we go. Have a pepper mill. You'd like to sell your pepper mill. Actually, who sent us the pepper mill? Hopefully that hasn't that wasn't the person that just walked in. <laughs> All right, then. Oh, it is. Of course. Yes, it is this, the... Uh, what do you call it? The twisting version of a, sh a shaker. All right, then I'll stick the price tag of 200 bells on this. If it sells, I'll put the money straight into your savings account. I hope we can find your new your item a new home. Me too. Bunny, hey. Hopefully you didn't send me that pepper mill. <laughs> Still, no one's bought the red nose. 
Okay, well, low tenant prices, so we're not going to be selling our tenants, but I think that's a good place to wrap it up. We bought some more Philly furniture, um, or 7-Eleven furniture from Philly, should I say. Um, and we also did a little quick tour of the aquariums, which is nice. So we, we need to start catching some more bugs, I think, and then maybe we can do a tour of the bug section as well. We bought a piece of art. Fingers crossed it was legit. Uh, and we planted some bananas, so not a bad day. I uh, hope you're still enjoying this series. Don't forget to comment any dream addresses you want me to visit or anything you'd like me to do. We are going to start laying some paths, but we need to keep speaking with Sable first so we can unlock the feature so we can scan in some cool QR codes. So we're working towards it, don't worry. And tomorrow we will, if I remember, we'll aim to get a wetsuit. Thanks for watching, everyone. Thank you, of course, to channel members. It means a lot, and I'll see you next time. Bye!